We have over 400 members, uh, right from Super Sixes up to under 16s. We've now got two girls teams. The value, obviously, financially is fantastic because um, you know the better equipment, the better facilities. A lot of parents would have to be constantly putting their hands in their pockets all the time, and with the economy, we don't want to have to do that to them. So that's why we seek as much sponsorship as we can. We wouldn't be able to afford these pads, you know what I mean? We wouldn't be able to do that type of thing, protection, uh, safety equipment, that type of thing. Win-win for both parties, basically. Uh, we've supported uh, the uh, Broad Beach Cats now since we started the business, um, nearly two years ago now. Well, been playing football here since I was 10, so sponsorship-wise, maybe 10 years when I started the business. The club approached us, um, they knew that I had a small business and um, you know there's a lot of volunteers that help out in the club, you know, running the canteen to cooking the barbecue and um, it's just one small way that we can help the Broad Beach, Broad Beach Cats stay alive. It um, takes the stress of worrying about money basically and the kids can get on with hanging out together and building that football family. They're a great club, um, they've been around a long time and they produce some great footballers, um, some of which are playing professional AFL now. So what a great thrill to be part of, you know, the grassroots of uh, Australian football. Sometimes they might need some equipment for the canteen or uh, if they need extra footballs or pads or, you know, training bags, all that sort of thing. We're here watching them at the games, um, they've got our sponsorship on their uniforms. We hardly ever advertise, I think the only advertising we really do is here. This, uh, you know, the signage on the fence or your, on the shirts. And I guess from a, a commercial aspect, um, uh, I think it's a, it's a neat thing to do as a small business to support the people that support you. I mean, I, I wouldn't be in business, um, I know it sounds cliche, but I just wouldn't have a business if it wasn't for the community around me, including, you know, mums and dads and families from Broad Beach Cats. It's a warm, fuzzy feeling too, I think. Sense of achievement with the, with the kids. Well, we probably have about 20 small businesses supporting us. They help provide much needed sponsorship to buy equipment and uh, football guernseys. Everyone can have their own in the right size. You know, they can get the football equipment they need for training. It would be very uh, under-resourced without uh, the money that comes from small business. The small businesses all help out with not just the kids playing football but making the, um, the club a better place as well. It is those couple of thousand dollars each from each sponsor that uh, actually builds up the coffers to allow uh, these clubs to develop, um, otherwise it would be uh, pretty scarce pickings. We couldn't function as a club without it. We tend to support the sponsors, uh, the, the small businesses rather than go somewhere else. When you're looking for a service and you don't know where to turn, you know that um, that person supported the club and so you're inclined to give them a call. I see myself as a lifelong sponsor of, of Broad Beach Cats. It's healthy, it's definitely healthy. It's a win-win situation.